Hey guys, welcome back to another Chainsaw Quick Tip. Today I'll be talking about an annular buffer on the Steel MS192T chainsaw and the 193T chainsaws. And these are the saws I'm talking about, the ones with the top handle like this. And what I want to bring to your attention today is the small annular buffer, which is located right here on the saw. And it's actually connected to the plastic part of the handle. And the reason I'm bringing it to your attention is because if this little buffer gets damaged like this one, what then happens is it puts pressure on your intake boot over here and your saw may not run properly because of that. This boot here has been replaced before but what can happen is it will crack your boot from all the motion because the buffer is not taking the shock or stopping the handle from moving up too high and that's why it's putting a lot of pressure on the boot. Not just on the boot but also where the boot is connected to the chainsaw. One of the symptoms that will let you know that this buffer may be damaged is when you grab the handle, the saw starts to idle faster. And again, that would be because of the pressure that it's putting on the intake boot. Now to get at that buffer, you do need to remove the chain brake cover. And then what you do is remove the T27 torque screw right here. And then you need to remove the two T20 torque screws. And here you can see the extensive damage to this buffer. So I wasn't really holding the handles. Now the part number for the new one is 1137-790-9900. It's an OEM buffer from steel. And here's a close-up view. I actually bought two to have a spare one. And now this buffer is very easy to reinstall. You want it in this position here. And now install the T27 screw over here. And now the handle is much more firm on the body of the saw, putting a lot less pressure on the intake boot. It is a good idea guys to check the buffers on your saws every year. If you use your chainsaws commercially, then I would check them every two months. So that's it for today's quick tip video on chainsaws guys. Please like this video, share it, and make sure to subscribe if you haven't done so already. You can also follow me on Instagram, Facebook, Google Plus, and Twitter. And have a great day.